Hi, I'm Dr. Kolbeck, and I'd like to talk to you about the importance of doing independent research. So why should you do research? Research leads to enhanced learning, particularly through the relationships between students and their faculty mentors. Independent research fosters critical thinking and independent problem-solving skills. And students who are involved in independent research are more likely to go on to graduate school or pre-professional school, like medical school. So how can you get involved in research? The first step is to find a faculty mentor. Find a professor who you've enjoyed taking a class with and ask them if they'd like to do research. From there, you can begin to set up your project. For my students, the first step is to pick something that you're personally interested in. Next, you'll want to hit the literature to explore what's known about your topic. From there, your advisor will help you design a project that you can realistically do. Then you can collect and analyze your data and present your findings at national conferences. All of the projects that we're currently working on have been initiated by students. Those projects include research on the microbiology and antibiotic properties of bird feathers, projects using PCR and sequencing to explore gene flow and speciation, projects on the ecology of hot peppers. This female turkey does not mind seeds treated with hot peppers, projects on sustainable gardening, projects on the physics of bird flight, and projects where we record and analyze bird song to look at the role those songs play in speciation. All of my students go on to present at national and regional conferences. We send students to the National Conference on Undergraduate Research every year, as well as the Missouri Academy of Sciences. Please feel free to contact me if you're interested in doing research, and thank you for your time.